Space 2. Going to write as I said, clock, 10 o'clock. <laughs> That's funny. That was good, dude. I really fucking enjoyed that. Come on, Isaac. You gotta do something, you can't just You complete bastard! Was this your great plan? Dump me off and die? Yeah, well, here's another one. I'm crashing through the roof to get you. Now move your ass. Wait, no, no, Ellie, it's too late. Stay clear of the station. Yeah, well, you don't really have a say this time. Heads up. Holy shit. There she is. Let's go, Isaac. Come on. Let's fucking live. No one, you're not dying on my watch, Isaac. This is too fucking cool. By the way, your suit's badass. Oh well, shit. Okay. Come on, Isaac. Here we go. Isaac! Take my hand! Fucking I'm trying! E. I'm trying! E to the max. <laughs> That is it. Wow. I like that little homage as well to the end of Dead Space 1. That was awesome, dude. That was about six, seven hours long campaign. That, I had a lot of fun with that. That was good. That was a really good story. And just, wow. It got me at some points as well, visiting the Ishimura as well. That, that made me edgy, because obviously the first Dead Space took part place on the Ishimura. That was just, that was just really well done, dude. I had a lot of fun with that. Can't wait to play Dead Space 3, uh, which I might be doing co-op as well with a friend of mine. But uh, we'll see. That was really fun, dude. Huh. I can relax now. I can have a drink. <laughs> What a game, Michael. What a game. I strongly suggest you go and play this yourself. Actually, as I say this right now, Dead Space 1 is free on Origin right now, I believe. So if you jump on Origin right now and uh, you can get Dead Space 1 for free yourself, uh, and did a playthrough of Edley also, you can play yourself, obviously, because that's more fun. Thank you all for joining me on this playthrough. I hope you've enjoyed it as much as I have and will continue to watch through other shit. That's exactly what my content is, it's shit. But yeah, <laughs> that was insanely fun, dude. Alright. I'm just going to let the credits roll out here if it starts a new video, so be it. Oh shit, I just realised as well, look at the very bottom. It's alien, it's marker language, and it's changing to English as well. That's pretty awesome. That was insanely fun. And scary as well. They, they got a good mix of action and scary between that, if you ask me. The first one was really fucking scary in the sense of you didn't know what you were facing. And this one, they managed to make that work. It felt like you were facing them for the first time again, almost. And I really, I will admit, I love the fact they made the melee so much better. Punching and stomping in that game, in this game, is just so much better than it was in Dead Space 1. And I love it because I can punch the fuck out of everything. And that's pretty much what I like doing. 
they got a really good mix of scary and action in that. Especially back on the Ishimura. That was fucking terrifying. I admit for an EA game, seeing as they're so popular nowadays, they did a good job with this. Visceral. Yeah. Oh, talk of visceral. Visceral Aussie Aussies. <laughs> I'm curious where the story's going to go with the third game now, because I'm doing this in 2014, Dead Space 3 is already out, so I'm curious where the story's going to go with it. I've heard some things, I've seen some gameplay, some trailers at least. I'm curious and I'm excited as well. I mean, to prove my exci how excited I am, I just did like a good 3-4 hour straight playthrough of this. Like, uh, this is my third day playing it now, but since probably like part 22, I've just been, it's all straight gameplay, like all one sitting. That's how much I actually play this game. Multiplayer, I might have to check that out at some point. Finer, human resources, they're all dead now because of the fucking necromorphs. So they are they still the necromorphs, or...? Because right then at the end, you saw them for what they are, and they looked like aliens, they sounded different too. So were those aliens, or were they still like the necromorphs made out of the people? That's not what I mean, I mean, I know they're made out of the people, like the bodies and stuff, but... I'm sure I can go back and reread through some of the text a to get a better idea of it. Because right then at the end, I go a little bit confused and all of I want to know if the necromorphs are still ne like people in the sense of like what they were in the first game, or if they're like actually an alien race now from like ages seven. Uh, I'm sure there's some fan fiction, some films to clear it up. <laughs> I actually have to go watch the Dead Space films. I saw the one that was after Dead Space One. There's one before and one after, like the prequel to Dead Space 2, which I've also looked at. I've, I've seen them all on both ends. Even the weird anime one where the guy gets his hand chopped off and like screams and gets himself to eat it. It's weird. I liked it. <laughs> That's a good point. I actually strongly suggest you go check out the films and stuff as well, because they actually do provide an extra backstory and it's great. So yeah, I think we're probably getting near the end of the credits now, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause the uh, video now and resume it at the end of the credits, because knowing me, this is probably like a two minute long video. <laughs> Alright, back in a second. I've got to admit as well, I'm back for a second, but I have to admit, the soundtrack for this game as well, that was pretty fucking good. Like, it kept the atmosphere going, which I really liked. It kept the same atmosphere of Dead Space 1, almost. Oh, and of course, the fucking suits. The suits are amazing. I want everyone. I want all the suits. So I want to me a vintage suit. And also, can that give me a discount in real life as well? That'd be beneficial. Because shit is expensive in real life. <laughs> Alright, I think we're probably going to be at the end of the credits. To the extent where it's actually repeated the first song. So I'm going to assume we're pretty near the end of the credits now. And like me, I'm very 